And in later developments of the refight of the Battle of Princeton, the Americans were able to take out the 17th Light Dragoons. Um, however, the Royal Artillery were able to cannonade many of the Continentals and militia, uh, which resulted in another battalion of militia fleeing, a battalion of Continentals fleeing off the battlefield. The American line now has a gap in its center. The American right wing is now taken up by a semi-militia regular brigade. The American left is actually made up of the majority of the Continentals, and the far left is actually a militia battalion. The Crown forces are reduced to a composite battalion uh, made up of companies from the 55th and the 40th regiments. We still have four guns of the Royal Artillery. Uh, three of them are in the process of being able to open fire. Uh, however, one gun is actually rushing to get into the defenses so that it may be undercover when the American line assaults the British position. That was a very interesting turn of events. The 17th Light Dragoons had actually charged in and scattered the American center. And thus, this is how the battlefield looks into the evening. Uh, I'll see if we're going to continue or if the Americans are actually just going to call this a draw, which they may check on a morale check with the American militia on the far left have passed. The Americans in the center have passed. Uh, the Americans on the right have not passed a morale. They've actually failed and are withdrawing which may be a setback for the American commander. They are in the process of patrolling off the battlefield. And Washington is going to try to rally these troops, but he may have a hard chance of doing that. Some of these officers no longer have regiments, so they have actually withdrawn from the field. The American far right is going to check its morale. It has now also failed its morale, so the entire brigade is now leaving the battlefield. Uh, thus, with this event, it looks as though the British have been able to hold off the American attacks, meaning that this has not been a historical refight. The British have actually been able to hold back the American assault. So, thus ends the refight of the Battle of Princeton.